Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can create an accountant's copy of your company file to give to your accountant should they ask for one. When an accountant's copy is created, you can still use your company file and then later import changes made by your accountant in the accountant's copy back into your company file. This gives you a bit more flexibility for data entry than the portable company file option does. To create an accountant's copy, open the company file for which you want to create an accountant's copy and then select file from the menu bar, roll down to the accountant's copy command or accountant's review as it's called in QuickBooks 2003 through 2006, and then choose the save file command or the create accountant's copy command as it's called in 2003 through 2007. Now if you're using QuickBooks 2007 through 2011, you then must click the Next button in the wizard that appears on screen, and then select a dividing date. The dividing date is the date before which your accountant can make changes, but you cannot. Once that has been selected, click the Next button to continue. At that point, select the removable media to which you will be saving the copy, and then click the Save button to create the copy. At this point, your original company file will say that an accountant's copy exists if you look in its title bar. You then give the saved file that you just created to your accountant to make the necessary changes while you still perform normal data entry in the original company file. Note, however, that you cannot make some kinds of changes to the company file, such as deleting, renaming, or structurally rearranging the existing accounts within your chart of accounts. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.